Greetings, I'm Trinket and welcome back to me. Here with the Aurora Array. And I wonder if May oh no amazing, don't be cute. What? Who? Beautiful, no. Oh, that. Oh, no. Oh, I need beautiful to breathe. Well, Aurora is probably going to make this baby a cactus collector. Ravina, and she is going to be harsh. She's like, you know what? This place is not bound for food. You are going to be an Omega Star. You're going to be an Alpha because you're going to be breeding. Rose is going to be Alpha because she gets to breed. Beast is already an Alpha. But he's the, he's going to have to be back. And so is Rose, because dangers are lurking. The star is going to stand over here for now. The cure now? I mean, we do have a lot of food saved up, but that's going to go down. So. Well, actually, he could go, he can go fish. Already made her. Might let them have one more baby. Spy is an Omega. But she can try to go fish rather than become a cactus collector. Minako is an Omega, but he's gonna collect that now. Scarpo, he's gonna stay a beta. He's a protector. Means he should stay in a like over here. Amazing is going to be one of the breeding now, so he's an alpha. Kiro is also going to be a breeding now, so he's an alpha. August, I'm afraid you didn't make the cut. But he can try to fish. Rock didn't make the cut either. You may have to catch black. Oops, actually made the cut, but Layla did not. But she's actually a beta. So if you can be protected in case Barry and show up. So she's no well she is also on the deck. And she I can't collect anything. I have not seen all there is a place to collect. Usagi is going to be a breeding female, so she's an alpha for now. And who do we have here? Taka. He is actually going to be a breeding male, but Isla is no longer breeding, and neither is Ghoul. Actually, they're going to be betas, because they can protect those lovely claws and fish. Oh, that was bad. Oh no, I hope it's going to be okay. Stag. I don't think he made it onto the breeding list. Oh, he did. He did. Never mind. Amazing. Okay. He's an alpha then. We're gonna pick up this mask. We're gonna protect. Uh oh. No, I made it oopsie again. Like, protect the baby, but that. Okay, he has two days to live. So they may have one more baby. And I think that's what they're doing over here.
can try to get that. Not to speed, unfortunately. Make sure none of have leeches. Siren is going to be a breeding creature, so she's alpha. Ismae is not, but she's going to stay in beta because she's helping find food down here. And Porcine is going to be a breeding creature. Um, I think... Oh, let's see what the road gave me. Two ladies. I think the bar is going to be some but I think you're glad that he's, he's done that bones and not that. I don't know anymore now. Do the next day. They look like Quinn. He looks slightly darker. At least he's not sick, but he will not be a breeding creature. Well, he can be a defender. He has a claw. But you... And um, they're just going to be called Curl and Rota without getting the signature numbers. Oh, did she not pass that on to him? Thank goodness. Hey, Phoenix, come over here. You can step there. And you, can, you can step there. You have to be protected right there. You are, you have a big moon. Um, I think they will call you, um, Knight. You are a generation. Seven. And you are staying beta as a potential defender. Somebody has to reach. You have one day left of your life. And can you... Oh dear. We're trying our best. Oh, there's just right there for you. Who are you? Lara. You know what? Lara, let's see. Terrible eyesight. But I want that beak. She carries the water body and the fishing tail. And hemophilia, apparently. Which we can counteract. And where did you show up on our family tree now? Uh, generation 8. We'll say you're of that generation. Her name is Sting Lara. It came with that name. And she can breed with anybody who doesn't have B or C. So not amazing the second. And not scarred out. You know what? He carries water body. Breed with him. And that doesn't work. This is his last day, so... There we go. October's gonna be so sad. I'm so sad. Don't really need that mask anymore. Is there something moving over here? Let's investigate.
Aurora's gonna be like, every time you see a rogue, kill it! Kill it with fire! And Star... Well, Star, I'm sorry your mate was... in a little bit of trouble there that you can't really take care of. Yep, Star and Beautiful are gonna be together. No. Storm is playing with my toes. What are you doing, Storm? Look at my toes! Uh oh. Who has a leech? That's a little stag, and there's nobody around to. Oh, she can't even make it over there. That's That's no good. And those over here. Oh, there's a clamshell. No such luck with the worms. And you can get this blade of grass. You get this one and can take fish anywhere. Other thing, I will have found to here. I will have found to here. Did he ca um Oh you carry crack John? He must have as well. Ooh, EMG. Will we do anything that to take care of this poor little fella? Is one of our breeding creatures. Or will be when he's an adult. And... Oh. He's going to be called Peppermint, Generation 7. Dot, he will be bleeding. Well, he has a claw, so he can be a defender. He's going to take up both of these masks. Oh, he found food! And you found, you also found food, and you should be down there, though. You're one of our breeding creatures. Ooh, a normal berry bush. How interesting. And then you can get these. Why are we growing grass here? Cool, why don't you get this? Oh, that's a dead koi fish. Oh, Kiro can get it. And I think... Okay. Well, here's some fish. We forgot to name you, didn't we? I like the name Chimera, but I'm gonna keep it. Generation 7. She might breed, so I'm gonna give her a temporary. Well, let's see, is she any better than Autumn? E.G. E.G. Both have two fertility, both carry hemophilia. 
eyes. Double blue eyes. Autumn, you are off the list for breeding. Your sister Chimera is going to take your place. I'm sorry, but he he has antlers shown. So I would like to keep that defense high or attack high. And you are no longer breeding. Autumn can at least I don't know. I think Kerr is going to try and follow his mother, but he doesn't want him to. And Rose is... Rose has to wait for Dictata to grow up. Where is Dictata anyway? Way over here. So Rose, begin your journey. Roll though it may be. I need you to... There's... Oh, that's a nice place to nap. I think Star might be a little like, who is this? He's like, he's like, they're both like babies almost. But I'm pretty sure he's an adolescent. Yes. Well, there's a couple of spots for them to uh, try digging up worms. Scar Pelt will not be breeding, but he can get this fish. Oh, Minako. Oh, I'm sorry, Minako, but that's the way of the Aurora Array. Okay, that's everyone moved, so let's see what surprise we might get from this. To the next day. You don't have a deformed paw? Oh, her father did. He's B and K. Here's the platypus beak, but we're gonna call her. Terra. Generation 9. Well, I don't know. I'm gonna just... I'm gonna go by her father. Or no, she... I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of weird. But I did hear dinner! By our weaker creatures. Oh, you're a breeding creature. I don't want you over there. You can do one hit and am spray. Well, there's a piece of food. Is there anybody else? And well, I don't want you to get any. I don't want my breeding creature sick. Oh, let's. Great, you're blocked in. Wonderful. Can you make it? Not quite that turn. But at least you found more food. And they have to wait till they're a little older. He's gonna take care of that. So move here. And that's not what I wanted to get, but okay. We've lost creatures, unfortunately. 
I'm gonna show her daughter how to do that. Whoa, look at your eyes. They're so big and beautiful and blue. I think you'll come over to protect this little lady. And you have to stay and protect your daughter. These two are just going to reveal this place. Oh my, this is a good place to nest. Especially if we were going to go to the jungle. Whoa, that was nice, isn't it? I think poor C needs to get out soon. As well as Kiro, because he is one of our breeders. And so is Siren. Oh, Isma is left all on her own. So, Stag. Okay, they share a female between them. Stag and Kiro are going to be with Amira. Is that her name? Yes. And, uh, I'm sorry, but it is as our current queen demands. Any non-breeder is probably going to end up being either a cactus collector if they don't have a claw or a defender if they do. Especially the double claws. Like, he has a claw, he has a claw, he has a double claw, she has a claw. She... I don't know why. She's... She can't even collect, so she's probably trying to do something before they kick her out. So beautiful and star. Don't think they'll have the baby quite yet, but after the, that fiasco, I'm pretty sure they're a little weary. And Rocha, okay, in case a Barina comes down here, we'll be ready. But Kuro, the cactus is your fate. Because that's how Aurora the Fifth demands it, as does her mate. Or did her mate die? Did your mate did your mate pass away? He did no oh, amazing. Well she's still in charge for the moment. And she says who can breed and who cannot. That's everyone's turn. So we're gonna see what happens here. Until the next day. Oh no! We totally obliterated him. I'm sad now. As long as he has other berries to collect, he doesn't have to play with the cactus. But Dictata is going to claim this nest for his mate. Um, oops. I think he needs to start going this way. As does Usagi. Oh, there's that berry bush that I forgot about. Horsing, you have to start going that way too because that's the direction your mates are in. And Buttercream, you need to get out of here. No, she took damage! What am I bringing the future? There you go, Scarpel. I think he might stay around here. And Tuck Kiernu is trying to hide from his responsibilities. And these two have to wait they're a little older before they can move anywhere.
and Gamera, 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 Gamera. Where are they? Okay, you need to start making your way to your mate before you get into trouble. And Rose. You need to start making your way to your mate too. Where is Siren? Where did I even put Dictata? Oh, he's claiming this nut, so the boys have to. Ah! I wish there were more berries there because, oh my gosh. This is hard for me. You need to have another baby, but with curl. Well, I don't think curl's going to be allowed because Aurora the Fifth is supervised as he collects cactus, and he's going to come over here and gather this. Pop back up here. Amazing, the second of. Uh, I probably clean this nesting area right over here. Whereas Beauty and her mate have claimed this area as theirs. Hey, Beast, are you on the list? No, you are not free. Can you get those fish? You can't. You're a defender, so they're going to have you move over here. And you could just find something to dig up. And you're male. Well, you're not male. Nobody around her is male. Is me, it's dangerous to be there by yourself. So I think we have one baby to look forward to, and then we're probably going to wrap up the episode there. So, to the next day. And she's dug- oh, he's a cutie. He is a cutie. And he has their father's eye color. Oh my goodness, look at those pretty orange eyes. Or the yellow. Orange. I think we're gonna name him Pumpkin for his eye color. Pumpkin. <laughs> Generation 6. And let me make sure that was taken care of. It was. So, until next time, bye!